life pounded down on me. Okay, so Guy's here and he's. Are you taking notes? Um, yes, I, I was producing. I have a question for you. Yes. Do you think it's reflective of Laura's personality that she chose the noisiest restaurant in the world, possibly, to have a lady brunch designed to bring people together? Um, no. I think that uh, the rollicking situation of, um, of a nice dim sum parlor is good. There were a lot of people, so it, like, um, basically you had small little conversations. You had fewer, like, whole table conversations going on because of the noise. But I do think, like, the environment of dim sum, of people being rowdy and having to yell at each other and grab for food, is helpful for people to just, like, relax and have a good time. So it's almost like the equivalent of, like, telling your life story to a stranger on a plane because you know you're never going to... Yes. The guy just stood up because he's... Casey is here. Hello, Casey. He's... And he can't walk. He can't. Doorbells are foreign to him. I don't know how to use them. <laughs> this door you speak of? <laughs> Paul's here. Right. And guy. Right. I'm going to go get Casey. Now. All right. Well, this is an adventure. I'm gonna. Hello, Casey. Hello. Casey, you remember Ms. Planker? Hey, How's Casey. Going? How are you? Doing Have you noticed well that yourself. Caesar's having a party across the street? I thought he's... that. I assumed that that was the place. No, and he's playing Bavarian music. Did you hear the accordion? No. We have to check this out. Should so we does Paula do live on this street? Yeah, she lives like 10 houses that way. But that's Caesar. Let's go watch the men's events. I'm spying on neighbors. For... I think your refrigerator is bigger than my apartment. Oh, okay. Well then, do you want to move in? Yes. Everyone's really nice. It's like you're a very small god. Tell, what was it like at E3 this year? And also, what did, like, what was most exciting to you there, Paul? To, to me, uh... I really didn't get a chance to play any of the games. I just enjoy going out there and staring at all of the pretty lights and <laughs> walking around. And uh, that, awesome. that's, that's pretty much my extent of E3. I, don't, I never get to have time to really, you know, wait in line and get to play the games. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Are there ever those times, like as a comedian, where we're just in a space that's like, like that absolute comfort of being in a space that's for you? The, the closest thing I can think of is like, in San Francisco, when I would go to the punchline on a Sunday night, where it was just sort of like, very much our space. Like, can you think of anything? Whenever I, whenever I really step into a comedy club, I, and, and I walk in the door and there's everyone I know is there. Yeah. It, and you're there. Then I feel like, when I walk into Westwood, I feel like that's our space. Yeah, and I, I mean, the thing about these, like, conventions and expos and please cons is that it's just sort of like boiling that down into three days or a weekend or something of just having like space that's very much yours. What was your E3 like this year, Casey? Uh, my E3 was pretty busy. I was out, we, Paul and I were both pretty much shooting every single day. Um, although I did get one day to uh, join the Nerd Stampede on Friday morning. Uh, and there is a video online at the Nintendo website uh, where you can see me for about four frames uh, dodging through some nerds to get to the, uh, the Wii booth. Um, did you wait in the regular line, or did you... No, I used, uh, the powers of the press pass. Okay, the podcast is over, and there's Paul, and there's Casey. Any thoughts? How do we do? How do you think you did? Do you have any um, comments about how you did? I was, I was very nervous. I don't know if that came across or not. No, it really didn't. I'm good. Thank you for having us. It's very nice. Uh, thanks for being here. Were you nervous, Casey? Uh, a little bit. Hmm. I hope that we approach a level of professionalism. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, afterwards. Thank, Jesus. You, Thank you very much for having me. With we us. had a um, brownout, so our internet connection. Oh, you're hugging me. Aww. <laughs> he gave me the low hug. <laughs> like the, the yeah. kind that Sammy Davis Jr. gave Richard Nixon. <laughs> I wonder if anyone's up there. Hello? Yeah, no, it, it, it was like the only several other people. Yeah, yeah. You got me. I hope that that brings it back. Uh, Ian's here. That's Is it a new? What do we get? We got I a new... got a HDMI out compatible Panasonic DVD player that also plays MPG4 video. How much was it? It was three thousand dollars. Hey, um. <laughs> hey, where's fake Jesus? Jesus. Which so. One? They're, they both yeah, played yeah. fake Jesus. But, uh, so Louise, is there anything else I need to do other than ask uh, Chrissy or from someone from San Francisco? No, I'm going to have you ask a couple of people. Email me tomorrow or the next day if you're having trouble, and I then will. we'll brainstorm. Okay, this is Caesar having a party across the street, my neighbor. He's 
he's got the very end accordion music. Can you hear it? And there was a Guy, are those real people singing or is that a record? No, those are human beings. Hi. Come join us. Really? The Croatian party at Sports I love the music. Yeah, that would be fine. And then this one guy walks. Show the Serbs who's boss. Alright. Bye. 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 Thank you very much. Thanks for coming. I would I shake your hand, but there we go. <laughs> Appreciate it. Thank you Hope so it was acceptable. It was awesome. Excellent. Good. You guys were perfect. Thank you so much. No problem. Any sex. Bye. 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 Thank you, guy. I'll talk to you later. I think that's a real accordion. Didn't it sound real? It does. It has been. Look at the sun. Beautiful. During the class, they put the chicken there. Everyone's drunk. Look at this. How cute are they? Awesome. Caesar has a lot of friends. All drunk.